Hello and welcome to my channel Virgos. Thank you once again for joining me. The reading that I will be doing for you today is what I'd like to call a flash fortune reading. It is a reading that will be focused on areas of your life that need to be healed as well as life focus cards dealing with work related matters, career. Um, I've also got angel answers in relation to pressing questions that Virgo has at this time. And finally, we will end your reading with an additional message from your angels. All right, Virgo? So I've gone ahead and shuffled and I have laid out your cards. And um, as always, if you're interested in a private reading from me, please access that information in the description box down below and I would be happy to do that for you. All right, guys. And as always, thank you so much for the likes, shares, and comments that you leave for me. I appreciate it so much. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So the top row that we have here are the healing cards and the deck that I will be using for that will be Healing with the Angels Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue. And the first card that came through for my Virgos at this time is the Power card. Usually when this card comes out in a spread, it basically means that you are in a seat of power to make great changes in your life, Virgo. Whatever challenges you had going on, I'm feeling for some of you recently, that you can overcome those challenges and that you have learned whatever lessons you needed to learn from it and it's time to move on. You have now gained the wisdom that you have gained as a result of those experiences and you are now more powerful moving forward in your life, all right? And you're more focused, which takes us to the next card for you, which is the focus card, Virgo. So for those of you who truly have lost your way and have lost focus in whatever area of your life needs healing at this time, the focus card is allowing you to come back to ground zero, so to speak, to have you quiet your mind and start over and to just refocus the area of your life that needed restructuring and that needed attention. Now, moving forward, for some of you, I'm feeling that you're missing your soulmate and your heart is truly in need of healing in regard to a soulmate connection that you've made. I am picking up the energy that you're not with this person at the moment, that the bond has been broken physically, that you guys are not together. But I also am feeling that for some, that that reconnection, reconciliation will be coming through in the future. So hang in there, Virgo. I totally am feeling the fact that you're feeling a lot of emptiness and pain as a result of missing your soulmate at this time. Whatever distance or disconnect is going on currently, that will shift in the future. And I'm truly feeling that there will be a reconciliation for some of you guys that are truly missing your soulmate and indeed needing that type of healing that's required in order to move forward until they return. So it's clarifying for you guys that you shouldn't put your life on hold waiting for this person to come back into your life. Um, but the energies again that I'm feeling at this time is that for some, the soulmate energy that you've connected with in the past will return. All right, so just hang in there in regard to those of you that this is resonating with. Now, moving forward, our second batch of cards here is dealing with your life purpose, Virgo, at this time. And um, the first card that came through is Infinite Abundance. So I'm feeling that for some of you Virgos that you're quite successful in your career, whatever vocation that you are in, you're fully supported as you devote yourself to your divine life purpose. It feeds your soul. It's a passion of yours and you're happy. And um, it's truly coming through for a good majority of my Virgos that you are in a place of abundance at this time, which is absolutely wonderful. It's also picking up creative expression, guys. For some of my Virgos out there, your soul longs to express itself creatively. So for those of you who are in some sort of creative endeavor um, by way of work, employment, something along the lines of perhaps being an artist. And actually, that takes us to the next card, which is artist. 
engaging in artistic activities is beneficial to your career and every other area of your life. So I'm picking up that some of you Virgos are artists. I am also picking up that uh, some of you are into music, painting, writing, creative writing perhaps. There are so many different types of vocation that fall into that creative expression. So if you are perhaps looking into change, changing careers in order to express yourself more creatively, perhaps you're at a job where you don't feel challenged currently, this card is coming through to affirm that you should certainly look into that if that is something that you're interested in doing. And of course, the artist card is coming through for my artists at this time, my Virgo artists. And for those of you that are really on the fence and unsure as to the type of work that you'd like to go into, especially those who are younger and in school and really quite unsure as to where you want the direction of your future to go, these are a couple of options that you could certainly entertain as far as a career, life purpose. Okay, so look into expressing yourself creatively. And uh, yeah, for some of you guys, it will be by way of being an artist. So that's wonderful. And for some, I'm also feeling that that's already a hobby of yours and you've been looking to turn it into a career. So this card is affirming that you should go for it. All right, Virgo? So the next batch of cards that I have here are from the Angel Answers deck by Doreen Virtue. And this is in relation to pressing questions that some of my Virgos may be having at this time. You've been waiting for an answer. You've been kind of contemplating how things are going to go in a particular situation. And the first card that came through is Abundance, which is fantastic because it's picking up off of the Infinite Abundance card that had already come through. So for those of you who are in a good place currently, it's simply reaffirming that you are in a good place and that you have so many things coming into your life that's putting you in a place of abundance. So that's wonderful. All right, that's th those energies are coming through. Now, for some of you who have been on the fence in regard to a particular situation where you're not sure the direction that it's going to go, the trust card is here to let you know that you should trust your gut just follow your instincts, and if it feels right for you, go for it. And the following card after that actually is yes. So yes, go for it. If it feels right for you, if you've weighed all your options, and if it truly is resonating with your heart, that it's something that would be good for you, then by all means, this card is affirming that you should go for it. Yes, and that it will bring you success. That is the final message from the angel answers that you will have success Virgo. So all wonderful answers that came through for Virgos at this time. And finally, a final angel message coming through is angel Serena. And wow, her message states, I am the angel of abundance. So that's the third card coming through Virgo. That's bringing through abundance for you. You will receive the money that you need. And God is in charge of how that will happen. So have faith. So I'm picking up off of some of you guys that are wanting this abundance to come in. But times have just been tough. And especially financially. And I'm feeling for some of you guys that you might be waiting on a promotion. And I truly feel that that's on its way. So if you're looking to earn extra money. If you've been waiting for money to be repaid to you. That is coming. All right, it's, it's coming shortly. So just have faith that the situation will unfold naturally and that what's owed to you will be coming into you. All right, Virgo. So those are the messages that I've got coming through for you at this time. There's no time frame for it. If uh, you're hearing this at this time and if it's resonating with you, then it's meant for you to hear it at this time. And uh, once again, it's general as always, so it's not gonna resonate with everyone. I'd be happy to do a personal reading for you guys if you're interested. All that information is down below the video. So that's what I've got for you today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much and have a great day. Bye-bye.